Good morning, happy Vlogmas day six. So I wanted to quickly give you guys a little OOTD before I do my makeup. So this sweater, which I love so, so much, I love the fit of it, is from Urban Outfitters. This is actually a bodysuit. It's like a grayish blue, and that is from Forever 21. The pants are buckle, and then the boots are faux snakeskin from Lulu's. And I think they tie in really well with this salt and pepper sweater, and I love it. Yes, 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 yes. Glossier Super Pure. Today is a Glossier morning. You guys know I'm a rep, so you can get 20% off your order if you use my link, and you can see all of my favorite products. I really need to refill this. Priming moisturizer. Perfecting skin tint. A lot of people complain about this, but what they don't understand is that it's not meant to be a foundation with a lot of coverage. It's just what it's called, a skin tint. So it kind of just evens your skin tone in a very light layer. So this is definitely for the days when you feel like wearing a no makeup makeup look, but just evening out your skin tone, maybe if you have redness or patchy areas but it really does, even though it's a subtle product, it makes a huge difference. Why do I look red? Do I look red to you guys? I don't know. Stretch concealer. One of the best concealers ever. Wowder. It is easily one of my ride or die powders. It's just so, so nice. There's no white flashback, it's amazing. It blends seamlessly, it doesn't look like you have powder on your face, and it makes your skin look flawless in a natural way. It's amazing. Boy brow, I really need to redo my nails. So I'm done with work now. Uh, this has been a long day. So right now we're at the bank again, doing some financing, and then we're gonna go pick up his new vehicle. So we won't be home till late again tonight, so I'm not sure what kind of Christmas activity I'm gonna do tonight. I really like doing Christmas activities. I don't feel like I have to for Vlogmas, but I personally really enjoy it, and I think it's really fun for each video to have some sort of Christmassy aspect or holiday or winter aspect. So I'm not totally sure what we're gonna do tonight. My lips are stained blue and my tongue because I just ate a blue candy and I'm honestly a little bit embarrassed about it. <laughs> so I wanted to give you guys a short little skincare routine sort of thing for winter because honestly I didn't really get a lot of vlog footage at all for today's video. And also I thought that this would be fitting because winter is upon us and I have really, really dry, sensitive skin, and I know quite a few of you who watch my videos do as well. So I thought maybe I could give you a few helpful tips on products that work really well for me. So first, I really like to start with the Ole Henriksen Pure Truth Melting Cleanser. This is such a cool product. It's kind of like heat activated, I wanna say, because when you look in the jar, it's like this orange, goopy jelly sort of consistency. And once you wet it and warm it up between your fingers, it turns into this really, really thin liquid, but it still gets foamy and it feels really good. It smells heavenly like citrus. I like to use this as a double cleanser usually, so I will remove my makeup with like a Neutrogena wipe or something, and then I will use this to really get in there and get in all the pores and everything, get all the excess dirt, grime, makeup, everything that is on my skin. So I just wet my face a little, and I just take a little scoop, like so. And you can see it like changes texture, it gets foamy. And as you can see, it really removed everything and there's nothing on the towel. 
So Dermalogica sent me this. This is the Clear Start Breakout Clearing All Over Toner. I have received this from them before and I actually used an entire bottle. So I'm actually really happy that they sent me a new one. But this is really, really great, especially if you want to target breakout areas and things, but it's just an all-around great toner as is. It's just really cooling on the skin and it feels really great and you can use it both day and night or either or whatever you're comfortable with. Then we gotta pay attention to the lips as well. So I'm using the Bite Beauty Agave Sugar Lip Scrub. This stuff is so, so good. I can't even begin to explain it. And I'll just let it sit on my lips for a couple minutes. Once I take that off, I like to do a combination of the Vichy Aqualia Thermal. This is a hydrating concentrate serum, so perfect for my skin type. And then I like to mix that with the Josie Moran Pure Argan Oil. You guys know I love oils, so I find oils to be a bit thicker than lotions usually, and so for my skin, I find it's much more moisturizing and I feel that it doesn't soak in immediately like some lotion moisturizers do it really i can feel it working and hydrating so that's why i like to combine things together so i just do a little pump of this and a few drops of that and then i do it in circular motions and i like to pat as well to really get it in to my skin because I do have quite a few patchy areas. I like to bring it down the neck as well. You gotta remember to moisturize the decolletage area. I like to use the Ultra Repair Lip Therapy. This is from First Aid Beauty. This is a long time favorite of mine. I've been using this, not this actual package, but this product for a long, long time. I just find it to be so moisturizing. And then lastly, we have to pay attention to the rest of our body as well, not just our face. So I typically, I'm not going to do it now because my hair is up. I like to use the Way Rose Hair and Body Oil. So I switch off. Sometimes I use it on my body, but sometimes I just use it on the ends of my hair because I have very, very dry, damaged hair since it's naturally curly and I straighten it all the time and heat damage it. So I like to add an oil because I feel like that helps nourish my hair the best. And then for my body, I like to switch off between different lotions. So currently I've been using the Charity Pot again. I have not used this in probably a year or two and then I got a new little mini version. So this is by Lush Cosmetics. If you guys don't know who they are, um, I'm sure you've seen your favorite YouTubers use a bath bomb by them in their videos because they are just amazing. So now I'm nice and clean and fresh and I just feel like my skin is so soft and I feel like it's being nourished and it's getting more plump and hydrated and yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this little snippet. So since I started off this video using Glossier, my favorite beauty brand, I thought it would be fun to do a giveaway with some of their products. So right now on the counter I have my products that I use, but I do have brand new, never use, never open products in the bedroom for you guys, but I don't wanna go in and get it because my boyfriend's sleeping. So I will just show you what is included in the package that I already have prepared for you guys. The first is the coconutbalm.com. This is, I have to say, it's gotta be my favorite one out of all of theirs. Now this is mine and it's very dirty because it's very well loved and used, but you'll be getting a cloud paint in the shade Dusk, just like mine. This is my favorite shade of all of them. They're all amazing though, I will say. And lastly, you'll be getting a Halo Scope. This is a Dew Effect Highlighter. This one's in the shade Moonstone, also my favorite. The reason I wanted to give this to you guys is because people are very picky with highlighters. You either love a glow and you like to beam to the gods, or you just want something very natural and simple, and I understand both. I'm one of the few who are right in between, right in the middle of the spectrum, because I sometimes am in the mood for a natural glowy look and sometimes I want to be beaming. So I thought that this was a good happy medium for you guys. 
You can build it up if you want it to be more intense, but just applying one layer, one coat will be really subtle. So the rules are very simple. You just have to be subscribed to my channel and then also comment down below any question of any category of anything that you wanna know from me, whether it's about my relationship, my hair, my fashion, anything, everything, the apartment, whatever you want. It's just gonna be basically like a Q&A because I've never done a Q&A before, so I wanted to do one and include it in tomorrow's vlog, and that will automatically give you an entry into this giveaway. All right, I'm gonna head to bed, so I will see you guys tomorrow.